What's up guys? All right, so today we are going to be working on a Four Winds Spa. Um, what's going on with it is uh, it's been off for a while and it's got water in it and basically I hope that the, um, the pumps kind of seized up from sitting and they might have a little bit of water or rust on them or something. So what I'm going to do is this panel comes off here. There's some screws down each side take the corners off, pull this panel off. It has the radio system, so you gotta kinda watch um, whenever you pull this off, you have to unplug all that, unclip it so that you can set this aside. So that is gonna be the first thing that I'm gonna do here is get rid of this panel. Okay, now, I got the uh, sides off of this thing here, and uh, this has the drain here. And this little plastic face unscrews, but you gotta reach back behind, which I don't know if I can get a good shot of that or not. Um, right here, this piece unscrews also. So it kind of sandwiches these together. So you wanna unscrew that so that you can pull this out farther so that you can get to the wiring for the radio. So I'm gonna do that next. Okay, there it is. There's your plastic cap that comes off. Like I said, that unscrews. And then you just take and pull that out of there. Now, we can slide this out a little bit. And here's my wiring. And I can unhook this harness here, which will get this whole thing out of the way. And then unhook these speakers off the back side here. So, I'm going to get to that. There's what it looks like with the back off. Now, from what I understand, because I haven't done this before, is on the backs of these pumps here, there's these little caps. You can pop these caps off, put a screwdriver in there, and turn these pumps. Hopefully, I got two of them here. Hopefully that's all that's wrong with them and there's nothing else wrong. So I'm gonna go ahead and give that a shot. And hopefully that'll be the fix. Okay, these are kind of in there weird. But you can see right here, I just removed the cover off of it. There's a little pry spot right here. You get in behind there, you pop that cap off. Comes off rather simple. And uh, there's a slot here for the screwdriver. I don't know if I can get a better angle at it. Right there. And when I turn that, you can kind of feel it was stuck. They do spin now. So hopefully that was the problem. I did the same with this one. You can see that screwdriver groove there. And it's now turned freely. So we're going to try it out here. <laughs> 